Welcome to part two of suffixes that shift stress one vowel to the left. That sounds weird. I hope you've watched part one first. Part two just has additional suffixes that we treat the same way. For example, how do I know if I'm supposed to say photography or photography? Which one is right? Let's find out. Next we have graphy. Now graphy is actually pronounced gruffy. Again, stress one syllable to the left of gruffy. Biography. Make sure you go up in pitch on that O and make it a full short O. Biography. Geography. Make sure the Y at the end of gruffy is a complete long E. It'll be low pitch, but it's still a long E. Geography. Don't say geography. Next we have IC or ICAL pronounced ick or ickle. Again, stress one syllable to the left of ick or ickle. Atlantic. Pacific. Now the verb for Pacific would be pacify. And in pacify, the PA is very clear. But when we change it to Pacific with an IC ending, the PA just becomes P, P, almost nothing. Pacific. Specific. If you made this a verb, it would be specify, and the S-P-E-C would be very clear with a short E, spes, but here it's just sp, sp, specific. Comical. Notice that I don't say comical. I'm not trying to yell at you. We don't want to be yelling at people, so we don't only use our volume to stress, so it's not comical. It's comical. I keep calm, but I go up in pitch. Comical. Logical. This rule, unfortunately, has a lot of exceptions, so here's a few that I found. Arabic. If we followed the rules, it would be Arabic, but that's not how we pronounce it. It's Arabic. Catholic. But let's pretend it's a noun. Catholicism. Then we stress that short O. Thal. Catholicism. And then the CA becomes K. It's reduced to K. But when it's an adjective, it's Catholic. Catholic Catholicism. Here's a really common word that's an exception. Politics. It's not politics. According to the rule, it would be politics, but we pronounce it politics. It's an exception. The next suffix is iffy, illy, or itty. Stress one syllable to the left of the I. Justify. Terrify. So the Y at the very end of the word is a long I. We don't reduce that long I, but it's quieter and low pitched. Terrify. Testify. So I wouldn't say testify. Now I have too much energy on the last syllable. It should be testify. Primarily. You can say primarily, but often with these adverbs, we don't need to pronounce that I. You do need to spell it with the I, so don't omit that in your spelling, but we don't need to say that I. Primarily. Necessarily. Temporarily. Ability. 
Now with these ity endings, and we have a lot of words with ity endings in English, the ity is pronounced i-d-y, a very fast d, itty. So don't say ability, that's too much t. It's just ability. Facility. Notice how the fa is not pronounced fa. It's just fa, very quick and easy, low energy. Save your energy for sill. Facility. Stability. If this were an adjective, it would be stable, and we would spend a long time stretching out that a. But when it's a noun, we reduce that a to a. Uh, stability. Next we have al or ous. Usually we stress one syllable to the left, but it really depends very specifically on the spelling. Overzealous. Tremendous. Momentous. So sometimes we stress two syllables to the left of O-U-S, but it depends on the spelling. In all of these previous words, I stress one syllable to the left because of the specific spelling. Let's look at that carefully. In this spelling rule, V means vowel, VC means vowel consonant. So you will stress one vowel to the left of the O-U-S or A-L suffix if the spelling to the left of it is not V, VC, IV, or UV. So in overzealous, the vowel to the left of OUS is E. Look at the E and everything in between the E and the OUS. You have EAL. EAL is actually VVC or vowel vowel consonant. Therefore, we're going to stress one syllable to the left because it's not a VC, it's a VVC. So it's pronounced overzealous. So in tremendous, the vowel and syllable before OUS is END. END is vowel consonant consonant. Because there's two consonants, we're going to stress that syllable, only one to the left of the suffix. Tremendous. In the word momentous, look at the E to the left of the O-U-S. Everything after the E is E-N-T. The E-N-T is vowel consonant consonant or V-C-C. Therefore, we will stress the E-N-T. Momentous. The same with tremendous. Look to the left of O-U-S. You have E-N-D. E-N-D is vowel consonant consonant. So we will stress the E-N-D. Tremendous. But if the word were, say, principal, we would stress two syllables to the left because I-P is just a vowel in one consonant. Principal. Look at the vowel to the left of the suffix and everything between that vowel and the suffix. In principle, I look at the I and also the P. IP is vowel consonant or VC. The same with continual. I look at the U to the left of the suffix. The U is all by itself. It's just a vowel. These are both combinations that we don't stress. Now we need to stress two syllables to the left principal, and continual. The next suffix, we will also stress one syllable to the left. Imum, I-M-U-M, maximum. Minimum. Optimum. Also, Y-S-I-S, -S, pronounced assist. Analysis. Paralysis. Next we have meter. Now meter is pronounced mitter when it's a suffix. Barometer. You really need to go up in pitch on that O and make it a short O. 
barometer. So it is not barometer or barometer. That bar becomes b, b, barometer. Kilometer. Speedometer. Wow, I even reduced speed to spid. Speedometer. Diameter. Some exceptions are decimeter. We don't say decimeter. Sorry, it's decimeter. Also millimeter. Finally, let's look at the suffix itiv. We also stress, again, one syllable to the left. Positive. Competitive. Because I'm not stressing C-O-M, I reduce it to C-U-M, come. Competitive. Sensitive. Did I tell you that itiv is pronounced with a D, not a T? So it's not itiv, it's just itiv. Fugitive. Example sentences. He wrote about his tremendous efforts in his autobiography. The politician understood politics but lacked sufficient data. The courageous mechanic wanted to become a musician. For additional information and practice, see my Udemy course on word stress. A link is in the description to this video.